ではしっかり服を乾かしてくださいね。俺はこれで失礼しますから。No, you're leaving me! Wait! <laughs> Just let me! Um. Shit. Well, yeah, that thing is so small. How? What? <laughs> Do you not want to stay with me? Uh. Well, shit, Biaki ain't making no argument for him to stay. He escorted me back to my hideout, but was prepared to leave just as soon as he arrived. Wait. <laughs> Don't leave. Ah! I told him to wait without thinking. Shit. I wasn't even sure why. So, our date is officially over? <laughs> yeah, that pretty much means it's over. Anytime you get soaking wet and you weren't intending to, the date's done. The, the, the activity is over. How about some tea while we wait for them to dry? Do you have a robe or something in there? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just gonna sit naked. No. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty lame sauce. <laughs> Why don't you have a change of clothes or a robe up in there? That don't make no sense. Change of clothes? You don't tell you or don't tell me I thought I was gonna read properly. Akaza, don't tell me you thought I was going to serve you tea in my underwear. <laughs> Shit, my birthday suit. Uh of course I wouldn't go about the rest of our date in my underwear. Well, that's the long term end goal. <laughs> It simply didn't occur to me that I needed my ch that that I needed to change my clothes. Ooh. Oh my! Why a warning? What did I do? This house, you can't take the privilege of not taking off your Uh, other routes. I say otherwise, but this route, sure, fam. I'll, I'll heed your warning. Don't worry. You're the only one who's ever been here besides me. No one else comes over. <laughs> the other routes say otherwise. They are Congo Ah, okay. <laughs> but why? What about my friend Tokisada? <laughs> Yeah, we say no men, no motherfucking men. <laughs> I can't even fight my friends. Sakini Moshiage Masuga, Oreva Tokisada, Shindai Stamus, Karega Sonoyona Koi, or Yobuta, Motte Nine, Betsno Danseo Sote Stekasai. Okay, King in Nitogaskna, King and Yiseo, Manekire. Okay. You're fair, fair enough. We've had our run-ins. What do you mean? Oh yeah, Bianca. Great, you better take his advice because that show the fuck happened. <gasps> oh, girl. <laughs> I thought she fainted or something. I was so startled that I jumped back and almost fell. Ooh. Yes, I will. I couldn't possibly believe I hadn't thought of that. What the fuck? I read that wrong. <laughs> I couldn't believe that I hadn't thought of that possibility. I felt so embarrassed that I wasn't sure what to say. Bye. Wait. He turned around quickly when I shouted. 
<laughs> He's like, Griff, you don't come on here. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? So, that's gonna be your job. I must have. Kill no, tell me you are. I must have. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yes, I do have a letter. I hurriedly took the envelope out of my bag. Ryoku at a disney. I can see. Even without his coat of wire uniform or glasses on, he reviewed the letter as usual. I wonder which was the real him. All of it, Chow. So, Yeba, Ryokuni wa mo ikimashita No, right? For this route, we haven't. No, not yet. I'm actually looking forward to going. Sono na no tori, midori a fureru utsukushii tokoro desu yo. I nodded in response. Akasa! I was surprised by how loud I was, but I wasn't as loud as I could get. Oh, um, I couldn't. I really couldn't believe he was the Iron Mask. He had done so much for me. Thank you. Thank you very much for today. You can't imagine how happy I was. <laughs> oh, God damn it when he smiles. Oh. I, I have to dry my clothes now. Uh. Girl, you know, if it were me, I'd be screaming in that, uh, laying down, face down, screaming into that pillow, because I'm an idiot. <laughs> Am I going mad? Yes. I stood at the door for a moment before running to the window. I peeked out and saw him walking away. I'm not sure why, but I'm so tired. I took off my clothes and hung them over the edge of the bed. No, it's not about being tired. So many things happened today. My heart was still racing and my body felt strangely warm. Girl, <laughs> Girl you know you in love. Already. Goddamn. Only one chapter in. Well, two chapters, sorry. I was actually there on Tenyo Island. I looked outside the window and saw the island floating in the distance as usual. I was really there. I was there with the Iron Mask. <laughs> Girl, you already have a flashback of a man from like two seconds ago. Come on now. Ah! I instinctively punched my pillow. <laughs> Olympia mad as shit punching the air. He's supposed to be the Iron Mask! How dare he do all that for me? How dare he make me want to fall in love with him? The strange feeling inside of me was tiring me out. I fell face first onto my pillow. See? See what I tell y'all? Now I should gotta do is scream really loud. And it's a wrap. I know that feeling. That Iron Mask! How dare he show me his kind side? Lady, what the fuck? I'm not even 18. I'm not even like 17. I'm probably what? Five? Six years old? <clears throat> oh, God. <laughs> Let me try to get my vocal cords ready. <clears throat> I don't know. <laughs> You mean like Mama and Papa? So, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I 
あの人の強さを受け継いでくれたようでよかった。Who is my damn daddy? <笑> Papa was strong? Can you fight the sea snakes? いつかあなたにあの人の名を教えてあげたい。Woman fight now! Spooky! You can tell me now! 口にしてはならないおきてなの。That's a dumb promise. How about just a potter's name? あなたは赤ちゃんの頃、泣き虫でね。お父様と離れるのを嫌がって泣いたの。Huh? But I don't cry anymore. Why? <laughs> I try not to sound like a typical toddler, but. Well, she's not. Well, yeah, my, I guess my is considered a toddler. I don't know. Whatever. そんな時。お父様はあなたを抱いて浜から海や月や星を眺めていた I don't remember. 私もあの人もあなたの運命を変えてあげたいでもどうすればいいかわからないのうん Is this like Guess who? Like, oh, the heck? <clears throat> Mama, why are you crying? Don't cry. Go, men, as I know. The more you look of a secret on the hazard on me. The more, Conoida, you may omit a no. もっと大人になったあなたが素敵な男性の横で幸せそうに笑っていたわ。OK。きっと彼があなたの。That's vague as heck though. Come on, lady. <笑> Mother, wait! Uh, another dream? I looked at Tenyo Island through the window. I remember that. Let me enunciate the words. I remember having that conversation with my mother before. I guess I've forgotten a lot that happened on the island. Was it because of the red calamity? Or maybe it's natural to forget the things from childhood. But I'm glad I remembered a little about my father. <laughs> that was like. Nothing though. Come on, spill the tea. What is who is your father? Even if I don't remember how he looked, let alone his name. Anata wa akachan no koro nakimushi de ne. Oto sama to hanareru no iyagatte naita no. Which means I must have seen his face when I was little. Hmm. My father's face. I must have been around three years old back then, right? I feel like I'm forgetting something important. I tried my best to unearth those memories, but it was no use. I couldn't recall this dream at all. I guess going to Tenyo Island made me have this dream. Maybe I'd Maybe remember I'd more if I went back to the island again. again. Ah! The feeling of Akaza's hand on my head came to mind and I shook my head violently. It's not like I want to be with him. Girl, shut up. Yes, it is. How was this a date anyway? Never again. Cap. I slowly got up from bed to check my clothes. Good. My blouse and skirt are dry. It's three in the afternoon already? I only need to go to the green, so I should have enough time. Maybe I'll have some tea first before I go. 
I turned on the gas stove to boil some water when I noticed something. A small cup and a clear drinking glass. Ah! I bent over... Bleh. I bent over the table with my hands on my head. It was the right decision having Akaza leave. I don't even have a spare cup to serve tea to anyone. Well, Riku didn't mind, child. I never thought about it since I don't usually have guests. What a strange feeling. I never imagined a day would come when I would think about someone other than myself. I should probably keep at least two cups here. Hmm? Is that a traveling merchant? I noticed a young man sitting near the bridge. In front of him were goods laid out on a cloth. I wonder if he has some cups for sale. Good afternoon. <laughs> oh, girl, can't even say good afternoon without men freaking out, having heart attacks and shit. I haven't said anything yet. There is no need to apologize. Still do it. I looked around and saw a variety of cute tableware. On one side were cups. Are these all for sale? How convenient. They're lovely. May I have a look around? Huh? Now watch him jack up the price like 5,000%. <laughs> <laughs> I crouched down to look closely at the cups. Oh, that's cute! This one is very pretty. It's cute from... If I... <laughs> I'm being very snobbish. Okay, from a handmade perspective, it's cute. I'm here for it. I love it. But I've seen, you know, some dollar stores or whatever with the same type of design and I wouldn't blink twice at it but if it's handmade and you know it looks like the shelves and the other decorations are actually coming out from the cup oh yeah babe I love it this one is very pretty the milky white cup was decorated with different seashells it was so beautiful that I felt as though I could look at it forever. So you know it's a buy. Do you have another one like it? <laughs> the discount of... A hundred thousand yet. I'm just kidding. I didn't buy these for Akaza. Absolutely not. I fell in love with the cup at first sight and decided to buy two of them. That's all. Not that I'll have a guest over anytime soon. For all I know, no one may come at all. They're really pretty, though. If no one comes over, I'll just use one as a bathtub for Daifuku. Yes, girl. Give your man the Daifuku's bathtub. <laughs> Start him teeing. Yes. Ultra petty. So, this is the Green District. I was mesmerized the moment I arrived, struck by the vivid green nature all around me. Look at these spools. I remember hearing the Green District is the best in the textile industry. That sound! <laughs> I guess being able to hear that sound again is a gift from Lady Amaterasu. Too bad I never got to learn. Still, the refreshing green and the dis distant excuse me, sounds in the air reminded me of my old life on Tenyo Island. 
I was walking along leisurely when... Toki? Yeah. Hi, Toki! Oh, Toki Sada! It's someone for that it's for someone named Takekoma who lives at number fifty-seven. Ah, How convenient. You know her? あっちでね。新しい染料になる草を栽培してるんだ。竹駒はその手伝いに。Really? Why, thank you. I handed Tokisada the envelope, which he carefully tucked into his pocket. I've never been here before. The Green District is such a beautiful place. So, you It reminds me a bit of Tenyo Island. The sound of the looms is so soothing. Hmm. Well, that killed the mood. I felt a sharp pain in my heart at his question. And here I thought I had accepted reality after what I experienced back at the spring. Aww. <laughs> Oh no, it's just that I was never able to learn before leaving the island. Uh, but I do like the sound of the looms at work, so maybe I should use this opportunity to learn. <laughs> Only if it actually turns out well. じゃあ、僕は王様の常ほどのに呼ばれてるから行くけど、またヨスガのところで発火ショコラ食べようね。See you later. I watched Tokisada dash away before leaving the Green District myself. Weaving. Now, where can I go to learn how to use a loom? It was probably because I returned to Tenyo Island, but I had this urge to do the things my mother did. Ooh, I would love to take me a nice hot bubbly bath. Thank you. I'll be there shortly. Maybe I can ask her. Chigaya, it isn't urgent, but could you find someone to teach me how to use a loom? Hataori, desuka? Naze, ikinari? I guess I could be honest with her. I actually went to Tenyo Island today. <laughs> Don't worry, I got there safely because the whirlpool died down when I went. Going there made me realize that I don't know how to yet. Let me read that again. Going there made me realize that I don't yet know how to weave, even though I'm of the white. Oh, that's right. I wonder if everyone here knows about it. The women of Tenyo Island are all skilled weavers, but I left the island at a young age. So I figured I might as well try now. How convenient. Oh! You know how to weave? Oh, that's wonderful. Then I'll be in good hands. Thank you. I hope he doesn't oppose it.
Chigaya gave me a warm smile. Really? Well then, good luck. Does this look good to you, Daifuku? <laughs> Actually, this is Akaza's handkerchief. <laughs> After taking a bath, I washed the handkerchief carefully so that it was completely clean. I can't believe the Iron Mask did that. <laughs> <laughs> no, darling. He did that for me. And that. My cheeks were getting warm just remembering what happened. I thought, I thought I first, at first I thought he was cold and ruthless. His Iron Mask nickname suited him well, but it seems he's not as bad as I thought. Girl, that wall coming down. Maybe. Okay, we must be getting a lesson in mythology. Not as exciting as a date, but... Eh. I'm here for the lore. No letters today. Well, Biakia, that is alright, because we have to end the video! So, folks, that's gonna do it for this episode of the Olympia Soiree playthrough. I had a good old time. I hope y'all did, too. As always, as usual, thank you all for stopping on by, chilling with your girl. I really appreciate it. Y'all know my philosophy on this YouTube shit. Be what you wanna, do what you wanna, and I'll see you lovely lads and lassies in the next episode. So until then, my friends, take care, take it easy, and peace.